Welcome back, everyone. We are so happy to welcome Darlin Mabins with Community Partnership of the Ozarks. And she's here today to tell us about the upcoming uh, Juneteenth celebration at the Galois Theater. So it is so great to have you. Thank you for having me. I'm excited to be here. Oh, we're so glad you're here. Yes, uh, would you mind telling us about Juneteenth? Juneteenth, excuse me, and the importance of it. Absolutely. Juneteenth is now a federal holiday as of 2021. It was signed um, into a bill and it started back in um, 1863 when the Emancipation Proclamation was signed and went into effect. And it wasn't until 1865 when the Union soldiers marched into Galveston, Texas to let the last vestige of enslaved African Americans know that they were now free. So that is the significance of it. It's a celebration of the end of slavery in the United States. And that, that was in June? That was June 19th. June 19th, okay. Yes. To wow. The significance of June and June 10th yes. and that, that date. That's amazing. Um, tell us about what kind of celebrations we can expect here in Springfield this year at the Galois. This year, um, Juneteenth has been celebrated in Springfield for a number of years. Um, Community Partnership of the Ozarks partnered with the NAACP chapter here in Springfield a couple of years ago and said, how can we grow this for our community? And so we are on our second year of having a weekend long Juneteenth celebration in Springfield. So we start off on Friday with a concert at the Galois Theater with um, we'll call it the turnt up tour. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> I love yes. that. <laughs> uh, we have three headliners, Twista, um, Paul Wall, and the Yin Yang Twins. So oh, we're seeing that now. Yes, that yeah. will start. Um, doors open at six o'clock. Tickets are on sale on the Gloys Theater website, as well as www.sgfjuneteenth.com. So they can still purchase tickets for that. Saturday, we are having a um, all, basically an all-day celebration at the Expo Center where we have local vendors, community members that will be there, food trucks, the police, Springfield Police Department will be outside. So that will be Saturday at the Expo Center from 11 to 4 is when the doors open to the community. That evening we'll be at the Springfield Art Museum for the Millie Project um, film that we will have and two of their performers will be there on hand to ask que answer questions from the audience as well. And then if that wasn't enough, we wrap it up. <laughs> we wrap it up on Sunday at Timmins Hall, which is a historic um, black African American church here in Springfield, or they will be informing people of all the projects the park board is doing, the city is doing mm -hmm. to um, increase um, and, and, and improve that area. Oh, that's amazing. Yes. It truly is a whole weekend long celebration. It is, it's the largest in Southwest Missouri. Oh, wow. Yes. That is amazing. Yes, it's right here in Springfield. So it, you said it's year two? Yes. Okay, yes. so what, I, I mean, it's, it hasn't happened yet, but what are you looking forward to next year possibly? Um, I don't know. Can it get bigger? Yeah. <laughs> we do a whole week long? <laughs> yes, a whole week long. We've been successful because of the support from the community. So the more support we get from our um, small business community, our corporate um, sponsorships, the bigger it gets. So we're very excited and, and excited to see what the future holds. Continue to do this mm -hmm. going forward. Why well, is it important for community partnership of the Ozarks to be so invested with this type of celebration? Is it educational? Is it celebratory as well? And is everybody welcome to come? Everybody is welcome to come. It's for the whole community. Um, community partnership is that organization that fills in those gaps mm -hmm. where we need um, support for our community, whether it's home homelessness or drug prevention and I believe inclusion is an area that Springfield has been working very hard in and this project was very important to community partnership to partner and, and make it bigger because we want to be that community that wraps its arms around people that are from all walks of life so mm -hmm. this is for our whole community. That's awesome. And for maybe someone just now tuning in, um, you know if they have got kids like why is it important to you know bring your kids out to this event? To meet other people from that you normally wouldn't run into on your day to day or your um, your I call them your bubble, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah <laughs> those true. that aren't totally. in your bubble because we have those here in Springfield. So venture a little further outside, and uh, we'll we'll have bounce houses at the Expo Center. So it is kid friendly, it's free for the family. Everything is free this weekend except the concert. So um, any events that they would like to attend is free and, and open to the whole family. Just imagine all the new friends you could meet. Exactly. Because you get into your routine of your life. Exactly. And you're going from A to B to C to D every oh, yeah. single day. And then you get in that routine. 
like you said, step out of that bubble and look mm -hmm. at like, like now we're friends. Like I didn't know you before today, and now I'm like, oh my god. I'm gosh. glad to know both of you. I was yes. like, I'm so happy. To, oh, that's the best part about this job is meeting so many great people in our community who are making a difference. Mm -hmm. So remind us again about the the tickets, how to get tickets for the Friday night Galois performance. You can go to the Galois um, website, the Galois Theater here in Springfield. Mm -hmm. You can go to their website and. Um, order your tickets or you can go to um, www.sgfjuneteenth.com and mm -hmm. you can order or buy concert tickets there as well. Okay, that's okay. good to know. And mm -hmm. then Saturday is 11 to 4. 11 to 4 at the Expo Center. Free entry. Free entry. Okay, and then what about Sunday celebration? Sunday is absolutely free as well. The okay. only thing that is is the concert. It's Millie concert. Project is also free at the Springfield Art Museum. Wow. And and what type of vendors will be there at the Expo Center? Oh, we have lots of small business owners. Uh, we have some of our local um, larger corporations. We have O'Reilly. We have Cox. We have Burl. Mm -hmm. um, again, the the love and support that our community is showing for this event has been vastly overwhelming. So there there will be a number of vendors. T-shirts. I mean. Mm -hmm. Uh, clothing to auto parts. <laughs> so, <yeah>. I love it. <laughs> they will. There, there's something there for everybody. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So you're That's supporting amazing. your community. Yes. You're supporting local. Yes. So it's a great event. There's no yes. excuse. There not is to no be there. excuse. Absolutely none. <laughs> well, well, one more time. That's coming up. What are the days? One more time. It will be June 14th, Friday, June 14th through Sunday, mm -hmm. June 16th. Yes. yes, guys, go to the concert, go to the Glories, meet new friends, because strangers are just new friends you haven't met yet. Mm -hmm. Like, now we're all friends. Now we're all friends. And please tell Johnny McNeil we love him. I will. We love Johnny McNeil so much. If he's watching, he's such a, a leader in our community, we thank you. And we thank you so much. He's a great guy. All right, thank guys, you. don't go anywhere. So much more fun on Ozark's Fox AM right after this. You think about it, it's so fun.